Hey, this is Dr. Davis, and this is how you do shoulder cars or shoulder circles. We call them controlled articular rotations because we're not just taking our arm and making kind of a lazy circle. This is not the exercise. We're doing a more active version of this. So we're going to carve out with all the musculature on 360 degrees of that joint. Every bit of muscle around that shoulder joint should feel like it's getting some activation. So this is not a passive lazy circle. You'll start by bracing the rest of your body. So if I'm using my right shoulder, and this is the shoulder that I have been instructed to perform these circles on, um, everything other than that shoulder should remain totally braced. Nothing moves. So you can even kind of start to squeeze the muscles throughout the rest of your body so that you remain like a statue. And then just this right shoulder joint for me is going to move. I'll start with my palm facing away from me and I will begin to move the arm ac um, across my body with that palm remaining forward. I start to squeeze the pec muscles and the shoulder muscles here. I'm pressing, I'm carving into this circle. As long as I don't feel any pinching pain, we can carve out as much range of motion and really squeeze into that circle as much as I can. Notice how slowly I'm moving. This is how slowly I want you to move. Should be unbearably slow. You should get bored as hell. But you're not gonna get bored if you're squeezing as hard as you can because it's really, really tough. Now, when you get to this top motion here, when you get to this top portion, right? So now your, your palm is facing out. You will hit a natural resistance. You won't be able to go further back. When you hit this spot, I want you to turn your palm to face out and then you can continue backwards. Now this tends to be a pinchy point for people in the top of the shoulder. If you feel pinching pain, I don't have to force it backwards. I can kind of back off the circle a little bit, navigate around that pinching pain, and then resume the full depth of my circle back here where I will probably have less pinching pain. You should end with your thumb pointing backwards and kind of twisted inwards and pressing way back. Then of course you reverse the circle. So the thumb points backwards. We start by moving the arm straight backwards, 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 really squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Natural stopping point can't go further. Now I have to turn my palm up and out and that's when I can lift and reach overhead. Really, really slow. This should take you, with the shoulder, it should take you like 30 seconds to complete one circle. And you should be squeezing those muscles hard. Unless you feel pinching pain, then make your circle a little smaller. Um, if you have problems, of course, come in and see us.